G'day Marcus, how are you? I'm fine. That's good. First of all, can you tell us a little bit about what you're looking forward to ahead of the season, mostly after last year? Yeah, do it better. <laughs> last year was shit. Uh, uh, we are a special club and um, I could feel it from the first day on this is something special here. I see it tonight, this is amazing. Um, and now we don't have excuses anymore. So uh, we have a perfect uh, training ground. Um, it's, it's, it's really amazing what, uh, what we can do there. Also we have a new stadium and this is uh, sensational. Um, and now it's up to us to perform, to bring uh, this what we can on the pitch with the passion what we have and uh, also for, for, for you, no excuses anymore. We have a home ground now and if we, if we come together, I believe, really believe we can do something special but we need everyone, not only the players, not only the staff, the board, we also need the supporters. If we, we are together, I believe we can do something special. Yeah, let's have a round of applause. That is, that is excellent, Marcus. You can see here by the amount of people that have turned out how much this club means to everybody involved. How much is that support going to gain out of having a much more settled home ground now, being able to play in front of our fans week in, week out, and having what we had a few years ago, which was not so much movement, not only away from home every second week, but at home as well with what came of that. Yeah, I saw the pictures from this time and it was, uh, it was like in Euro. Um, fantastic atmosphere, crazy crowds pushing the team. And this is what I mean, you know, uh, last year I understand everyone who is saying, uh, ah, listen, um, I don't want to go in the A and Z or uh, the sport list because there's no atmosphere. And also for the players was it difficult. Also for us as coaches to, to don't have an atmosphere. Um, it's, it's not easy to play a game without the atmosphere. And uh, so this is what I said. So now it's up to us, everyone, for the players, coaches, but also for, for the supporters stick together, give everything, and uh, we will have a fantastic year. As you mentioned, Marcus, last season was a disappointment, of course. How high have you set the bar now for all of these players to, number one, buy into your philosophy, and number two, breed that into success for the rest of the season? Last year, I couldn't do a lot. You know, the, I came, I would say, in 98% was, was, was there, so I had uh, to work with them, uh, yeah, what I had. And now I could change a couple of things and uh, I think we have an exciting team because the mix in my eyes is, is perfect. We have still many young ones, uh, but also we got older guys there, very exciting players and um, yeah, I'm really positive uh, looking forward to, yeah, uh, to, to play a good season because last, last year was, wasn't good. How impressed were you with the younger players? We've seen them come through in the FFA Cup. We've seen a lot of academy graduates coming up now and staking their claim to merge together with the experienced players as well. As we've seen, Alex Meyer has come a very experienced player. He will be able to give a lot of those younger players plenty of tips. Some of those players, of course, will be half his age. So it's something that that experience is invaluable. And how impressed have you been with the younger players coming through? Yeah, it's up to them. I think this here is the perfect place for young players. Um, it's a great opportunity to, to, to play in the first team, um, but you have to work. And if you're better than the, the older guys, it's a big chance there to play, because I, I'm not scared to bring a young one. And uh, I think I showed it in the past. But also, we have uh, older guys, they, they don't want to give the place away till they're fighting for the spot. So it's, this is what I want. I want to have a competition and everyone has to, to work hard for, for the sport uh, under the first 11 and um, I know yeah, there are talents there but uh, uh, you have to work for, 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 for the success you know this is um, it's not um, yeah it's, 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 I, I don't give a present so they have to deserve it and um, if they do it I'm there Excellent, Marcus. I won't bore you any more with these questions, but thank you so much. Those magnificent responses. You are looking magnificent tonight as well. Thank you very much. Any final messages to the fans out there other than get ready for a big season? Yeah, please come. Please come. Believe in this team. I believe and, uh, we have many exciting players in this squad and um, we, 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 have to, we have to make history now. 
we, it's all about us to bring everything to this club because the club is amazing. I love this club and uh, you will see if, if we come together, we have a great season. Thank Excellent. You. Ladies and gentlemen, let's have a warm round of applause please for our head coach.